Hi guys and welcome to another Divi video. This is Jamie from System22 and WebDesignAndTechTips.com. Well we have a question that keeps coming up and it's how do you add an add to the cart icon with amount of products you've added to your cart and a few people have asked about price. Something like this we've got here. We've got a little cart icon, the amount of, num amount of items in there and the price that your cart is. And it's really easy to do. We're going to use a simple free plugin to do this today. So let's head over there and I'll put this link below the menu. The plugin we're going to use today is simply called WooCommerce Menu Cart. And like I say, it's free. So I'm going to go ahead and download it. I'm using Google Chrome, so it downloads to my browser here. Yours may download to a different location. That'll be your default download location that's usually in documents and downloads okay now that we've got it downloaded let's go to our plugins and that's to the dashboard down to appearance and plugins and let's go up to the top and add new little add new button on the top we want to upload a plugin I'm simply going to drag mine from down there to where it says no file chosen and drop it there and hit the install now button. Okay, it's been installed, it's very lightweight. I'm going to go ahead and activate the plugin now. Okay, we're good to go. And there it is, WooCommerce Menu Cart. Now to actually use it, we need to go up to WooCommerce. And in the drop down, you're going to find Menu Cart Setup right there. And it gives you the option to use it on various different platforms. We're using WooCommerce, so that's the one that I'm going to select today. Hide the theme shopping art cart icon. That's not a bad idea because you don't want two of them up there if you've got a theme with an icon up there. Now you choose the menu that you want it to display. I've got two menus up here. This one's called Cats for Category and I can't remember what that one's called but I'm going to put it on this Category one right here. So I've already got mine selected there. always display cart even if it's empty yeah I quite like the idea of that I don't want to show cart on the checkout page or the cart page because you know that's gonna to be too much information they've already got it there if you want to you can just check that we want to display the shopping cart icon and with the free version it doesn't look like you get the uh, menu fly out there that's fine now there's no option to choose any of the other icons here but that standard one that you get with the free is fine if you want to upgrade to the pro you get all these other features there but I'm just using the free one for this today what would you like to display you can display items only just the number you can just display the price only the amount that they've spent or both price and items I'm gonna leave it on that at the moment you can align it left, right, or default. I'm going to leave mine on the default. That works for me. And the price to display, cart total, including discounts, subtotal, or checkout total. I'm happy with cart total, including discounts. If you want to enter a custom CSS class so you can style it, enter one there. And it's just told me that this is only available in the pro version. So that's fine because I'm happy with what we've got going on here. Let's save our changes. And once saved, let's go to our little page here. I can close the other page up. And I'll refresh this page. And we should have a little shopping cart on the side there. So let's refresh the page. Okay, and there you can see we've got the shopping cart icon, the number of items that are in it, and the price that's been spent. 
Let's just add something else to the cart. And as you can see, it's now up that to three and up the price for us. So that's a great little addition. And like I say, I get a lot of questions on how to do that. And it couldn't be easier with a little, little free plugin like that. So there you have it. I hope you've enjoyed this today and found it useful. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, ring the bell, comment, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Once again, this has been Jamie with System22 and WebDesignandTechTip.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.